dragonflies will come after me and try to kill me. Which is one reason why you never want to kill one of the uh, dragonflies in this area until you're capable of taking down a beetle bum. Because all the beetle bums will try to avenge the uh, dragonfly that didn't give you very much experience in the first place. Uh, I'm down to eat this. No, I did get to eat it. Okay, good thing I tried, sort of. And uh, let's go on to the next floor. How many uh, thingamajigs do we have? We have a total of three thingamajigs, and we need four thingamajigs. It's freezing the zone, and the zone has been thawed. Oh boy, it's bones. I think that just might mean that this place is a lair of some legendary beast, I think. I think that's how it works. So we're going to have a lot of fun here. But first, let's eat the bones. No, we cannot eat the bones. Let's get the bones, because they have a special message, and I want to show that off to people. I think they have a special message. I'm probably wrong, though, as usual. Hey, you're a jerk of a plant. Why are there so many jerk plants in this game? Can't have just... Well, there are some nice plants. Can't just have a really helpful plant that wants to help adventurers out. Okay, we can leave now, but I want to figure out what this thing is in this place. Stop it, plants! Okay, I hope it's not a legendary plant. Um, let's try to uh, be a little sneaky here. Light him on fire, and maybe it'll spread to his neighbor. Meanwhile, we're going to walk all the way over here. And, uh... Fight jelly. I hate jelly. Jelly is not a fun thing. And we are in a bit of trouble. No, we're not. Ha, I got jelly everywhere. Stupid plant. You got jelly on you. Sort of. Stupid plant. You got blood all over you. My blood. Charlie Sheen's blood. You have any idea how valuable that stuff is? You are in perfect health. I am scared of you. Um... Good job. I, I took care of it. Charlie Sheen took care of it. Someone's coming towards us. And that's a very scary guy. Oh, that's not good at all. And, uh, it's nice. We were able to take that guy sort of down. Uh, there you go. Keep shooting at it. Take these little shots. And, wow, you missed a terrible time to miss. Oh, well. I would like to attack, but I am incredibly scared of doing so. Uh, I take five damage, and I hit for one damage. Whoa! Let's use Scorpion. First, actually, let's use, uh, let's use Scorpion. Stance. F. We are now in Scorpion Stance. Look, we can look at our character and it says, Scorpiox Stance. Lots of other silly things you can look at your character to see. Sometimes you can't see your own character, uh, you, you can't see your own stats, though, because a stat makes you not able to see other things like you. And then you can't see your own stats, and then you have to dominate another creature in order to see your own stats, which is a very weird thing. There should be, I press the, uh, I, I press this button over there, that was actually a button I pressed, and uh, now you can see your stats. Oh well, who cares? What's, what's important now is the fact that we're going to die, probably. Badly wounded. Yes, I was not wrong. Or should I say, oh, no, we're still sane. How are you, guy? I don't like you. You are going to be lit on fire, I think. And then I'm going to poison you. And shoot long-range attacks, so I have to be careful of that. I cannot let myself be diagonal or anything like that from you. And you are now injured, which is a nice thing. And now I'm going to have to heal. Because you're a jerk. I think you can do long range attacks. I'm not quite sure. Or I'm not quite... Oh well. You're going to be walking into the water maybe. And that's going to cause steam. No, that's going to make you not on fire anymore. Oh well. Let's shoot right there like that. And we'll be able to shoot him. And let's run away now. We can't see where we're going. But hey, we can shoot at things. And that's what's important. Stupid wounded guy. I hate you. I hate you. Oh, well. Aren't you still poisoned? No, you're not poisoned. Did I ever poison you? Uh, I can't do anything nice to you. Or rather, mean to you. Oh, well. Can't do that. I can do that. So I'll take a little shot at you. Poison you. Stupid poison jerk. There you go. Take damage. Take that, jerk. And we got 325 experience. But we also lost some nice things, which is a little... Not so happy. And we should probably leave now, now that we know that there are dangerous enemies here that can kill us. Or at the very least, uh, consume many of our resources. Like those Witchwood Barkies. 
But instead, I'm going to continue, and I'm going to light that stupid kudzu on fire. So I don't want to uh, fight him any other way, and I can't use my lays to go through walls. Apparently they actually fixed that, so that doesn't work like that anymore. I hate you, stupid quilliped. How about you go away? I don't want to fight you. I don't know why I'm singing. Okay, I'm not going to waste my fire kindle on you, because I want to waste it on that uh, quilliped if it gets closer to me again. Like, now! Well, then... This would be an excellent time to do that because I am terribly wounded. I'm going to die. There you go. I take nine damage. Yeah, I'm not going to be fighting that guy direct. Why are you not calling fire? I can tell because even though your sprite's all weird, it's not all weird. You're injured now. Hate you. I hate you. I hate you. I'm running away and I'm never coming back. And we'll never know what legendary thing was there, because I said, as I said, I'm never coming back. How about I just take the little shortcut here, even though it's a long cut, of, oh yeah, the stupid plants are preventing me from uh, mapping properly to the exit. I have to go a certain distance so that the guy won't run into any more plants. And now I could get the zone to get pro properly work together. And let's get some more Witchwood Bark while we're here. And there are hostiles nearby. I don't see any hostiles. Come over here, hostiles. I'm waiting for you. Ah, uh, you're not... Oh, there you are. Wait, you're not hostile. You're a friend. Where's the hostile? He's not coming to fight me. Where are you, hostile? Okay, I'm just gonna go to a, a little area where nobody can see me. A little crevice. And we found some ruins. No. Let's actually go down for a second. Hopefully not to the same ruins that we just found. Because then we'll immediately be surrounded by uh, uh, ants and die. We don't want to do, but I want to get some more witchwood bark, so I'm willing to risk uh, f uh, my thing foolishly, far more foolishly than I should be. And there you go, you're now on fire, and you're stunned too. And now you're also a dead guy. Hooray, let's pick up some more items now. Oh, you are a jerk of a salt hopper. Oh well, you're going to be lit on fire too, guy. And you're also going to be poisoned, I think. Are you poisoned? No, that was a failure. I could just look at this thing. You resist the effects of my venom. Darn you, salt hopper. Oh, well, now he's on fire, and we're winning. And we won. And there's nothing here for us. So let's just move right on on. Oh, where we still have that torch. We can extinguish that for now. And go back to the world map, now that we got what we wanted here. We don't need a uh, torch to see here. In fact, that would be a really nice uh, little touch to this game. If uh, during night, if you uh, walked around without a torch, there's a higher chance of getting lost. Oh well. They already have a time system. I've never brought anyone's attention to that. But it's cut 7 p.m. And now we found ruins. No way we're going there. Actually, we might be going there by accident. Yes, we did go there. Hey, can we, uh, is it a witchwood bark? It is a water vine. I didn't realize that. In fact, really, that was a witchwood vine on top of a, uh, dog bark, I think, judging from the image that it gave us. Oh, well. Let's go down here, and Tam has restocked. Hooray, maybe... Oh, we failed to harvest something useful. Maybe we can get something useful from this guy, but first, let's turn that quest in. And we need to, of course, see this guy in order to use telepathy, so let's walk all the way up here, and then use telepathy on you. No, use telepathy on you. Yes! Let's give you the wire telepathically. Do we still have the wire now? We probably don't. And you gave us an item. Thanks a lot. We drop it and then it disappears magically. Even though we were talking to him through telepathy, we were able to turn a quest. That's great. That's what you call a glitch. Or I call it glitch. I don't know what you call it. And we did get our items successfully. There was nothing uh, bad there. Oh, we didn't get our second quest, though. Let's get that now. Uh, AC, to do that. Could try to uh, map that to something, but I don't want to do that at all. So, yep, now he says, splendid, splendid. Time to go to those really nice Brathromites that aren't at all fishy once they ask you to do certain weird things. Hey, uh, guy who I keep forgetting the name of. Go, we can pick this stuff up. Get that. Get everything. Your Tam. Yes, Tam. And Nylon Backpack. That could be a useful item for someone who's not me. Huh. Of course, we can't get really very much money at all from any of this. 
and you don't have any long thingamajigs. Hey, Uber Nostrum, that is a nice item. I think I want it for the sake of uh, having it. Cause it's always fun to have certain things. Oh, these are probably just uh, grenades, but he's charging a fortune for them. Same with the, f yeah, the fix-it spray and the grenade, I think, probably cost the same amount, uh, always. Oh, well, um, that's a good way to identify things, I suppose. If, uh, I know the NetHack has identify the, uh, squirrels based on their price, and I think stats might affect how much it costs or not. So, you could probably figure out what certain items are, at least what tier they're in. Uh, the grenade one tier, the grenade two tier, the uh, other thing that's not a grenade. I don't know the weird artifacts there are that uh, aren't incredibly expensive. But you can probably use that to identify things. How about I actually do something, though? Ha, <laughs> short bows only get uh, t me three each. Okay, I'm going to be uh, a jerk. And even though they're incredibly cheap, I am going... Whoa, that was a little weird. Kept going even though I didn't want it to. I am going to unload every single one of these. Or the one, I guess. And hooray, now we have lots and lots of arrows. And the game's being slow. Probably because I'm running something right now. Uh, that uses the com a lot of the computer's computerliness. Which hopefully won't mean that this recording will fail like so many other recordings have. Can't st stress how annoying that is. And hooray to red to signify that we have too many pounds. Shame that there's nothing for how many pounds he can hold. Just to be realistic, even though it wouldn't serve any purpose. By the way, the bones we picked up are useless, making them no purpose. Let's actually eat them. Uh, I mean, they're not useless, you could eat them. But they weigh a lot, and they don't actually sell for anything. That hits spa. Oh, I thought it said, I thought it said something about crunchiness. I guess that's only the ancient bones. Have I shown you guys the ancient bones yet? Doesn't particularly matter though because other people have shown that off. And so long as other people have done something, it's illegal for you to. That's the rules of Let's Playing. I should be talking about this game. Shut up already. Uh, do we even want anything? I do want to figure out. Oh, here's an easy thing. We know it's a grenade. We know these two are the same price, so they're probably grenades. Um, yeah, I don't really want anything from you. I can get water from you just to have the water. Uh, because eventually. Uh, It'll be difficult to get massive amounts of water because these guys just run out. And you can't keep trading with them. Um, let's trade all this stuff. We got iron long swords. I think we have uh, already good enough uh, thing of iron long swords. Still short sword. Ought to steal, but none of them are long sword material. And we only want long swords, even though it's probably only worth uh, having one or two, and then using it. No, the scorpi scorpioc thing only works for long swords. Sell all that and we are only getting uh, 157 uh, drams for all that. I guess it's not so terrible. And if we sell all these short bows, and this is after exploring two dungeons that we get this. Just to add some emphasis to this failure of uh, a trader that we're controlling right now. 195.5 drams. Wait, you have zero dram? No, you have um, 165 drams. So we can actually buy you out of every single dram you have. Uh, it's not.